Hello and welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. Um, more of those please. Oh, I want to produce that. So what does that need? That needs some of these. How many? 20. 2 times 10, so that's... Does that mean 20? Let's try and see. Gotta be careful of these embers. No, it's just 10. That's disappointing. Need more of those. I presume I will eventually be able to recognise these blocks and have a look at what they are each time. So that's buoyancy of four. That's buoyancy of five. Hmm, but higher durability. This is slightly annoying me, the fact that I have to keep moving stuff from one side to the other. Oh, I need to produce some more of these now. Buckets of water. Apparently buckets are made out of scrap metal. Interesting. Night time is approaching. So all I really want to do is make this weld tool. And presumably I can weld stuff together then. What oh, takes five? Oh well. I need to go and find some more of those components. That is one item you don't seem to be able to craft. There's our well tool. I need to put some of this walk milk in the fridge, I think. Ah, that's getting a bit full. The most, I'll grab some of those. And I'll show you why in a sec. Uh, I've got some... What are these? Red beet. Okay. Right, let me put this in the... Just a minute. I've added another chest to this site. I'm thinking potentially we could use these vacuum pipes. My limitation at the moment is going to be embers. I need a lot of embers to produce these. Couple anyway. Let me give you a show of what I've done in the dark. As you can see, the base has changed a bit. Got a roof over the crafting area, a, bit, got a table to sit down and listen to the radio on. Somewhere to sit. And a cupboard, which has got nothing in it at the moment. Seen the fridge. But most of the changes have been downstairs. I have two Wokos. I managed to attract them. And we can get back in there. Using corn, lure them over to here and build a little area around them. Didn't really want two. Wanted one really, but two got in here. So I'm not complaining, but it just means the food is spread over two rather than just one. Obviously I would get probably more wok milk with just one. But we're doing quite well for walk milk, as you can see. Day 
Daisy 1, Daisy 2. Anyway, that's not the only thing we've done. Oh, as you can see the area extends outwards. Got a little bit of shade for them. We've been to that village down there and scrapped a lot of that. In fact, we're going to pay that another visit, I think. I'm going to have to rebuild this. But the main thing I'm proud of at the moment is I have a gate. I worked out how to use the controller and the logics and the switches. So you can open the gate, drive the vehicle out. I'm not sure if I put the switch in the right place, but you can reach it just and close the gate. Which I thought was rather cool. So basically, I've turned the recording wrong. We should have started during the day, but we're here on the night, so we'll wait today. And I want to go that way because there's that packing station, and I need to investigate a bit f further. And there's that village on the way that we can scrap most of the items from and bring them back to help defend the base. Ah, we have vegetables. Mostly carrots. Seem to produce producing carrots a lot at the moment. I just water these plants that I put in. I think about it, I might as well get some buckets of water up to make those containers of water so we can produce some metal. Are they all watered? Just double check you, just to be on the safe side. This is how you set up the motions of the gate so it's open and that's obviously closed. The two actions of the switch is as I open and close and the logic gate is set to XOR. Took a bit of a while to experiment to work that one out but eventually got there as you can see. Basically that's how I find out how to do it. Right, so these... Oh, I've got to put them in the chest, have I? You're having fun, Mr. Bot. in the fridge I think. Coming on nicely. Food supply. Right let's get these buckets back and it's time to go exploring I think. I'm pleased with that. I, it's a small thing but it's the first thing I've managed to get right. I think red is quicker than this, but never mind. We're out here now. Might as well make the most of it. Uh, avoid the rocks if we can, it's quite as bumpy enough as it is. Any damage that time, that was good. Oh, I took a bit of 
damage that time. However... I don't know what these things are used for other than decoration, but we'll take them. I had to be a little bit cautious about the weight I'm adding to this car. It's not exactly powerful as it is. Come on, where, where did you go? Scrapped. How's my inventory doing? I've got a couple of spaces. Oh, I'm full. Right, so let's go and have to investigate down here. I don't like those wings. I just hope I can get back up the sill all this weight on board. to the engine. So these are the things we can pack at the station. Carrots, I presume that's broccoli. I haven't seen that yet. Red root and tomatoes or tomatoes. Depending on how you want to pronounce them. Right, I can hear you, robot. Where are you? Aha, there you are. Oh, component kit.
Keep out. Well, that makes me curious. What have I got to keep out of? Oh, what's this? Hello, there's lights down here. Interesting. There's somebody in a cage there, or a box of what looks like vegetables. So there's the platform. Place them on the platform, push the red button, and they get taken sucked up by looks of it. See what happens if you push the red button. Nothing. Is that because there's nothing there to suck up? Welcome. Oh, hello. Oh, you're the trader. Ah, I've heard about you. I've also heard this. It was a slave. Is a slave trade in this? Oh, look. Spud guns, spud shotgun, spudling gun, mountable spud gun. So, bags of soil fertilizer. What are you? Banana seeds, orange seeds. Oh, I see. You can trade those. Be yes. Oh, three lots of carrots for banana seeds. Cotton seeds, saw blades. I know I can manufacture those. Where's that gap? I came out of oh, there. It is. That shows seven bars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven bars. Does that mean seven fruit make a what's it? So I can't yeah, empty my inventory a bit. There's one. There's the other one. Good component kits is exactly what I need. Need to start stockpiling those, I think. So we got those embers back at the crash site, so if I return to the crash site, A, have they respawned? 
if they respawn, and B, if they don't respawn, are there any others I can collect there? Because we need to produce lots of metal, that's what I'm thinking. See, that trader isn't that far from our base. I haven't been over there yet. That's a big building over there. Well, I think we get this lot back first because we can barely move as it is. 